This may be a little off the wall, but did you ever think you'd be as successful as you are? Yeah. This may sound off the wall, but I did. I don't know why I did. But of course, I had a lot of rough times getting where I am today, but I never kind of lost hope or lost faith that that's what I was kind of supposed to be doing. Mm -hmm. I suppose it would have been a real rude awakening if I had, if everybody had said, go, <laughs> go home. In regards to Charlie's Angels, was that a curse or a blessing for you? Oh, I think a blessing. Oh, absolutely. It was a great experience. I had four years in front of a camera and four years of experience and became known. And I mean, it wasn't Shakespeare and it wasn't, I think I, in a way I have some, some typecasting things to get over. But as time goes by, I'm, I'm being offered better and better parts. I just try to do a lot of different things. I, I, Hopefully I didn't confuse everybody. I mean, I think a lot of people are not quite sure what it is I'm about, but that's good too. When you finally made it in this business, was it as good as you expected? I, I kind of, it's kind of that, is that all there is adage, I guess, because it's real hard work. But I enjoy the work. I think if you don't enjoy the work, you're in big trouble because the celebrity part of it gets pretty old and money doesn't make you happy, success doesn't make you happy. It sounds corny, but it's true. Cheryl is the ambassador at large for Child Help USA, a live-in facility for battered and abused kids. All of these children are, are placed here by the courts. They usually stay here on the average of two years. Then they're put in foster homes or adoption agencies. And some of them are united with their families. And that's what this work is all about. Of those who are returned to their parents, the success rate has been 100%. During the time the children are here, they receive counseling and a couple of things that have been missing in their young lives, love and affection. There's a sign over the door right here. It says, all who enter here will find love. And they do. This is your house? Oh, it's great. What's this up here, the antenna? Oh. Touch it. Does it bite? Does your turtle bite too? Let me see. No, it tickles. It tickles. Cheryl, of all the charities in this country, why did you choose this one? Well, I guess primarily because of my concern basically for children, having uh, a daughter myself and, and a stepdaughter, and having had a really nice childhood myself and great parents and loving guidance in my life, and what a difference I think it makes in someone's life. They can be such vibrant and healthy parts of our society if they just get a little love and a little guidance. So that's, that's what this whole thing is about. When you experience something like Children's Village, it keeps you really down to earth and keeps, keeps a hold of your old values and what's really important.